Hey everybody and welcome back to Cyberpunk TV, Deus Ex Revision. I'm talking quietly so the guards don't notice me. We're still in Paris, listening to that super chill piano jam that I will not shut up about. And um, trying to figure out where we're supposed to go. Which is not a particularly easy thing. Whoa, weird. Okay, hold on. Well, this is interesting. So where am I now? I'm by, there's those two gates, there's that giant robot. So I'm kind of near that one. I should have looked at this earlier. So if I could get up to the second floor, that'd be pretty cool. The well, second floor of this building, actually. But uh, right now that's not gonna be happening anytime soon. It's fine. Just don't, just don't worry about it. Just don't worry about it. You guys are assholes. All right. Um. So that's basically the same as usual. No, hold on. So, if I, if those pictures say what I think they say, which is that I need to get onto the second floor. How do I get onto the second floor? Here's the robot. There's where I am. How do you do that? Doesn't say. Hmm? There's entry one, but... So there's the station that's out of service. Okay, I don't even know what I'm doing, man. No, listen, buddy. Your face is a butt. All right, let's go back a little bit. You know, we have the power of time control. We can go back to this glorious moment. When a robot made my dreams come true. Bless you, robot. Bless you. Okay. Um, so here's some boxes and stuff. Yeah, thanks, robot. Um, oops. Images. Boxes and stuff. There's this. Heavily patrolled area, too. Alright, so... There's where we came in, and here's down here. Wait. So we're not actually downwind of where we came in. That that's that's not right. No robot, stop! Ugh. Hold on one second. Listen, I'm not a murderer, but I wanted to defend my robot. Oh, what? What are you going to do? That, I guess. <laughs> okay, go back here. Go. Okay, so here's the entrance. I've made a ton of progress in this level. It's just not in an orderly fashion. All right. Oh, I've got a plan. I know what I'm going to do. Come on over here, guys. Come on over here! Come fight my robot. Now, hopefully, they won't be able to shoot as well. No, never mind. And they're immune to clouds, I forgot. Okay, so that doesn't really work. Wait a minute. Okay, hold on. Now, I really need to figure out what exactly I'm aiming for here, you know? It's like, here's where we came in, possible entrance. Wonderful, we just came out of, you know, the, the abandoned metro tunnels, right? No, we came out of something. Fought a dude, messed around, go down here. Fought some dudes, messed around. There's 
V2, right? Is this the same place from a different angle? Yeah, because there's that. Okay. So then the entrance to the catacombs is through those gates where I was before. No. Where? Oh, I know. There... I was over there. And over here is the other area. So I actually have to go in here. Okay, hold on. So I thought that those gates were the same, but they are not the same. They are in fact like, yeah, see, there's like an entry, an area in between the two. Also, can you please not? Can you please not? Oh, come here, an ass. I guess you can't not, because you're terrible. All right, so I'm in a weird place. I actually snuck, I'm very close to where I need to be, according to my map, which is not super reliable, so never mind. But, um, yeah. So, I'm just gonna wait for this guy to go back this way. And I'm gonna go over here, and I'm gonna try to get through the gates behind the robot, which I know is gonna be hard. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wait for him to just turn around, and then I'm gonna save. All right, I'll save. Okay. Now go this way. Now sneak, real gentle-like. Real gentle and slow. Son of a bitch, just go. Just go through. Okay, so th th the damn doors are locked. Alright. Okay, new plan then. Just gonna... Do a bad thing. Equip. Bad thing generator. Alright. <laughs> Stupid idiot. He's gonna come back here and kill me now just because I said that, but I don't even care. He's just... What'd you get, buddy? Did you get a big grate that got blown open? That's what I thought you got. Alright, let's save. Uh, <laughs> I just wanna go peek out over here. Is he just gonna. He's just gonna. Lord. Our sector's live. Repeat, live. Yeah, I don't want to watch him kill me and get his comeuppance, so I'm just going to not do that. Um, I could shoot a rocket or throw a grenade over there. Nothing. There we go. You just walk back where you go. Back over there. Go. Go, go, go. <sighs> okay, now turn around. There you go. All right, save. Wonderful. Now, everybody's chilling. Robot is stomping away in a different direction. Everything is great. This is wonderful. All right. Um. Go, 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 go. <sighs> okay, so we made it to a place. Uh, wherever we are. We made it, we made it to a Parisian garbage dump, I guess, or fenced in garbage area. Mm-hmm. That's pretty cool, man. It's weird that you know that, but uh, I'll take that. Not in the tunnels. Huh. <laughs> so, Silhouette is pretty much in the dark as to what's actually going on, which I guess makes sense. <clears throat> because we asked them to go to ground when I warned them with Paul in the beginning. Well, not the beginning, in the warehouse job where I fucked everything up and died, but hey, worse things have happened. What? Oh, cool. Hey, dude, what's up? That's a dead mechanic. That's kind of sad. Oh, 
cool. I have a catacomb gate key now. Okay. Neato. Um. Nope. Nope. Reports I'm finding indicate a siege on the catacombs. MJ-12 must be trying to drive Silhouette from their hideout. Oh. That's unfortunate. Ugh, come on. Go back on there. Whatever, I quit. Um, hmm, okay. Are these boards breakable? They don't look breakable, but they might be. I can't really afford to go through that smoke until it clears because I have absolutely no health left. But, um... Uh, I, don't, I don't really know, man. Oh, it's locked. Okay. Hey. What we got? Some darts. Some more darts. Some flare darts. Some more darts. Some more darts. Is the smoke clear yet? Okay, cool. Alright, let's see if we can get through here without getting our butt kicked. Because that sounds like a trap. Actually, all of this sounds like a trap. You're entering one of the larger tombs. Almost six million exhumed bodies were moved to the catacombs as a health measure to that's pretty cool. Your butt's got a bogey. Not dealing with this right now, man. Sergeant, is that you? Watch, Watch yourself. This one's some kind of mech. Nope, I don't have any ammo for this. Tech Sergeant Trevor. Private Kevin. Glad you guys are around. You guys are way better than the stupid guys that I can't poison. So you guys are just chilling? Alright. Kevin, come here. I don't really want your flamethrower. I just want you to chill. I'm gonna run this whole campaign against the catacombs. I'm just gonna fight my way through entirely with snacks. Listen, so if you decide you want to be a Majestic 12 Commando when you grow up, I'm going to have to snuff you out. I don't have any other options. They are There's, like, not really a way to take them down non-lethally. Gotcha. You, however, are just fine. I don't have to kill you. You're fine. You're still safe. It's just the, 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 the robot voice guys that are immune to basically everything. Like that dude. That dude's getting a rocket. Actually, that dude might not have to get a rocket. Let's go this way. Nope. That guy... Yeah, that guy just getting him the rocket that he so well deserves. <sighs> okay, did I just... Yeah, I just took care of those guys. Next guy is a normal... A normal guard. This is gonna be bad. This is gonna be bad. This is super bad. Sneak forward gently. Yep. Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Not gonna go the way I want it to. Not at all. Okay. Any hint of grace not happening. Sort of calm, collected, anything? Nope, not not at all. Nothing like that. Alright.
Anybody else? Guys, listen. I really, you don't make, I don't want to do this. But you are making my life miserable. Although, also slightly better. Now I can heal up. At least most of the way, anyway. I'm not going any further until I, yeah. Save. My no-kill playthrough turned into a, like, barbaric violence playthrough, but I'm doing the best I can. You're close to the bunker where Silhouette has barricaded themselves. The leader's name is Chad. Strange. The area looks different than it does on my map. Hmm. Some new construction. Maybe they've concealed themselves from Majestic 12. Probably? I mean, that's what I would do. Okay, well, it was worth a try. Um, okay, that's a thing that exists. Um, I'm nearing the bunker, so that means we're close, but I don't... I don't know, man. Hmm. Okay, so this is where I wrecked those dudes. And this has basically just been a big circle. And this is the room that I went in before. Has a cool locked door. JK, something opened somewhere else. Oh, sick. All right, let's go. Silhouette, it's me. Hey, man. Make sure they don't follow you. You found Zabunka. How did you find us? Where's the girl? Oh, hey, girl. I found you guys because your bunker had a bunch of wine bottles around it. <laughs> we are surrounded. We don't have much time. That's fair. Oh, what up, kid? Who are you? I came to help. Majestic Twelve took my mother prisoner. Where? Bunker free. Chad has a key, but he says he's too dangerous to try to rescue her. I'm on my way to see Chad right now. Maybe I can change his mind. Is that a, was that small child um like a lady doing a small child French voice because that's what it sounded like to me. So I don't really need any of their food supplies and I feel kind of like a dick. We can't let them discover our hideout. That's fair. Um Chad, I'm looking for. Oh, what's up? You're probably Chad. Hold on just one second, buddy. You guys are scratching the bottom of the literal barrel, guys. Come on, save. They are holding our comrades prisoner. Oh, you're not Chad. Who the hell is Chad then? Chad. We are not prepared to fight a war. Well, I. Bruh. Lady, they bruh. Backed us into a corner. I understand your situation. I'm just. Oh, that's Chad. Cool. What's up, Chad? J.C. Denton. You might know my brother Paul. I helped him send your group a warning about the crackdown. Denton. Mm, yes, the satellite transmission saved us from La Prison de Fren, at least. Pretty much a skeleton crew you have here. How long can your people hold off MJ-12? We are not mercenaries. When the troopers moved into the crypts, half of my people retreated without firing a shot. Two of them took a wrong turn and were taken prisoner. Where? In Bunker 3, the tunnels behind the second blast door. Maybe I can help you out, in exchange for a small favor. I need to find Nicolette Duclair. Nicolette? What do you want with Nicolette? I need to contact some friends of my mother's. <laughs> oh yes, Beth, a great woman. Nicolette is very secretive about her mother's friends. She tells us that they are wealthy and support our cause, but they have many enemies and need to be protected. I might be able to help you, but I, I must be certain of your loyalty. You have a right to be cautious. 
Just point me to Bunker 3. I have the key to the blast door, which is directly across from our hideout. And a map you might find useful. Get my people back and I will put you in touch with Nicolette. Cool. I can dig that. That's pretty okay. Um, can I steal from your cabinet? Is there even anything in there? I don't think there's anything in there. But you know what? You never can tell. What just happened? Game. Keep it together for me, please. We're getting close. There we go. Oh, he's got Shakespeare in his cabin. That's cute. All right. Um. We are surrounded. We don't have much time. Yeah. Okay. So hold on. Kiddo. I'm afraid. Yeah, me too. All right. Let's go. We are holding our comrades prisoner. Bunker one. We can't let them discover our hideout. Is this the way to bunker three? No, this is the way to hang out with this girl. Prepared to fight the war. What's up? They have backed us into a corner. You're doing a little rougher than the people inside. Maybe you should take a break. I mean, just a quick break. You must assume the worst. Yeah, that's fair. All right. Um. So he said there was another bunker directly across from this one. I guess that would make sense. All right, um... Oh, crap, that one opens this one. I don't want to do that. Close that. There's like 62 different switches. Okay. Um, so if that's Bunker 1, and this is Bunker 3, is where's Bunker 2? I'll open that and turn away so you can put that away. I um, hate to tell you this, but they call me Mr. Crossfire. Like, that's that's what happens around me. Everyone I love is meat. They're just, they're dead. I'm really worried about how this is going to go. What the heck? Where the heck is this place? That's not great. That's super not great. Get the heck out of here. Go, 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 go. Robots cannot climb small inclines. It'll be fine. Another World War II bunker. No sign of MJ-12. Maybe it's vacant. Isn't it bunker 2? I think bunker 2 is cursed or haunted or both. Hey, what's up? Get out. I was here first. Sorry, just looking around. Aren't you afraid of the commandos? They better not come back here. I am not moving again. Right, you tell them that. At least I get away with something. Want a med kit? I stole three. Or what about those poison darts? 600 for a med kit, 200 for the darts. They move me out to make room for military supplies. Dude, I'll take the darts for sure. I'll take the darts for 200. Good deal. Also, can I have the med kit? I'll come back here, man. Okay. I'll take him. Good deal. Sweet. Thanks, buddy. I hope you do better with that coin than I did. I don't think you're doing super hot, though. God! Ouch. Alright, um. Okay. So that's bunker two. Did you hear that? I heard that. So where the hell is bunker three then? Oh. Spikes are spiking. How do you check? Sonics are spiking. Sonic's a hedgehog, you filthy animal. I'll come and get you. 
I missed. I missed. <laughs> uh, every time. Okay. Alright, here we go. Got him. Everything, it's fine. I did it. It's all good. Uh, this new play style is not super great. It's also not very uh, sustainable. I've only got five rockets left. I hear something. Every one of these bunkers has had like a super ghetto light, light that sounds like that. So I'm just going to look around for something to open it. Eh, I don't know. Let's blow open this. Well, that was kind of useful, I guess. All right. Um, I don't think it was a fair trade to trade a lamb for a charger prod battery, but maybe. Okay, so this way goes all the way around here, and then eventually. There was a robot over there, so I could go back there. This is Bunker 2, I'm sure of it, right? No, this is where I just was, fighting that other dude. Alright, never mind. Let's go back up where the robot was and chuck a frickin' EMP grenade at him. I'm taking the long way around apparently, but that's okay. Nope, don't leave. What is going on? I am literally just going around in circles now, and I never had this trouble until just this minute. Okay, so there you go there. Now, this way? Yeah, okay. That's Bunker 2, I'm pretty sure. Yep, okay. Super chill Bunker 2, just a, just a bum with a bunch of med kits. All right, but over here, I distinctly remember there being a robot. That robot. Acquired. Robot's not dead. Robot is definitely not dead. Okay, uh, that was super dumb. <laughs> can we try? Can we try again? Like, do a better job, maybe. <laughs> it's not fucking likely. I mean, maybe, but probably not. And I'm going the wrong way again, aren't I? Yeah. <clears throat> okay. Okay. This is super hard, but... Man, I thought... I thought that nothing could be more labyrinthian than the sewers, but I was obviously wrong. Do you ever just think that game developers make things like this because they really don't know what's left to do? The old catacombs exit is at the end of this passage. Due due to cavins. Yep, it's been closed off. Did you know? Did you know for the for years it's been closed off due to cavins? The old catacombs exit is at the end of this passage, but it's been closed off for years due to cavins. So this doesn't help anyone. Is what you're trying. Got out. I didn't get anything good, but I got I got it. Did it. <laughs> Survived. <laughs> um 
So what did that whole bit with the robot accomplish? Why is the robot guarding this area if it's nothing? I am so mad. Okay. Um, orange soda. A 40. Should I just follow the beer bottles? Bunker doesn't belong to them. They're just in it. Okay, get your act together. Come here. Come here. Oh, why did you do that? You had a gift. You could have shared that gift with the world. Instead, you accidentally blew yourself up. <gasps> that turns robots against their friends. Oh, I need to get in there. I don't know how to get in there, but I need to get in there. Which way looks like the way that you would actually go to get in there? Okay, so probably from this way. For the first time ever, I'm like super excited. I'm super jacked to get into, um, what is this? Is this the way back out? Now, what the hell is this? Oh crap. Oh, cool. Well, that's nice. Um, what the hell is this? Like, where are we? Other than an area that wants to kill me. Um, save. What do I have that, like, do, do I have anything that reduces damage? I don't think so, so let's just... Oh, <sighs> okay. Hold on, there was like a little break in the electricity. I saw it. I saw it. The robot has to fix it. That's cute. All right. So like, what the hell am I doing and where am I doing it? Also, thanks robot, you're a super big bro. Um, is, where does, does this lead somewhere? Definitely. That's not what I wanted. Darn it. It's not what I wanted at all. I wanted my pepper spray. But I bungled the controls because I was climbing down a ladder. Do you know how cool it is that the robot goes over here and fixes this? Makes me really, really happy. Check goggles. Multi-tool. Okay, let's climb down the ladder with our pepper spray already out. Okay, here we go. Perfect. Alright, um... My incredibly violent brand of stealth has temporarily won the day. Well, that's... Nice. I went in a big circle. Uh, all right. Wait, what does that do? Nothing. All right, cool. I was just asking. Huh. Hmm. kind of crazy when you think about it. Hmm. Okay, so I need something to get through there. Oh, I have something to get through there. 
It's a one-way ticket, but it'll work. Okay. So that didn't go super well. So they pretty much can expect me now. That's definitely something. Um, what, do I, what have I got to work with? I, I've got gas grenades, but the last time I used gas grenades on a hostage situation was really bad. What are you trying to do, buddy? I want to believe that the troops in here... Oh, God. Okay, so this, this is not exactly going how I wanted it to. That's okay. Any hey, 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 lady. Lady, 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 lady! This depresses me so much. There's a 50-50 chance that I can't touch the bad guys. And that makes this very hard. Okay, hold on. One of these sides has got a thing on it that I can interact with, right? Maybe not. Maybe that's not how this works. And that's just there to be a cool computer uplink. Wait, what did that say? Huh. I've got enough multi-tools to hack my way back out of here. What did tech goggles even do? Oh, they do exactly what I already have. Well, isn't that neat? These are stupid. <sighs> Oops. Alright. This episode has gone a little bit long, but I was kind of in the middle of something, so I think we'll save right here. And next time we'll rescue some hostages. Hopefully. Alright, thanks for watching.